Okay, I buggered up the intro and the outro big time. So yeah, the, this video, just a forewarning, is going to have a pretty abrupt ending. But anyway, here's a sort of makeover intro. I am going to be rehousing some pretty grumpy customers today. Not centipedes, as my channel usually features, but a bunch of funnel web spiders. So I hope you enjoy it. All right, now the first funnel web I'll be dealing with is my female Atrax Robustus, a Sydney funnel web. Now she is my biggest funnel web and she's also very, very temperamental, so I gotta exercise quite a lot of caution when dealing with her. So here's the enclosure I've got prepared for her. Got some sphagnum moss, some cocoa fibre sand mixture, and um, a nice branch here for her to fix her webbing to, because Sydney funnel webs in particular do like to spin some pretty cool looking web curtains, so I thought I'd put that this in here to encourage that behaviour. Now onto the fun part, actually the less fun the better to be honest. This is her temporary enclosure. She lives in this little hole here. Uh, let's see her. Come out, come out and play. Really, where are you? Don't make this difficult, but you are a funnel web, so I guess you're... I guess you are gonna make it difficult. Oh. Oh, hi. Hi, how are you? Come on. Alright, well there she is. Atrax Robustus, Sydney Funnel Web. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's just try and get her out of this enclosure first. Don't pose me. Good, 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 good. Good. Well, so far so good. There is always room for error when dealing with these guys. Admittedly, they aren't quite as hard to wrangle as centipedes, but still, you know, okay, okay. Well, take a, oh, okay, she's threat posing. Okay, okay, calm down, calm down. Look, I'm just getting you into a nice new home. There is nothing to be cranky about, okay? Now, let's, hey, hey, behave, behave, my lady. My fair lady, come on. Okay, so what I gotta do here is guide her into, come on, look, the, the threat poses aren't even scary. You're just, you're just a cute puppy dog in my eyes, okay? In, back in, back in, stop dancing. Is that all, you are, you're a good dancer. Okay, stop dancing. Yeah, 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 we get it. You are big, scary spider. Go, get in the box. Thank you. Thank you very much. Keep doing your dancing in there. I don't care. So let's get this feisty little girl into her new home. Hi. You are still very, very angry at me. Holy crap, those fangs look insane. Get a bit of light on her. There we are, there's some more detail. Look at that. Oh, of course, once I get the spotlight on you, you stop dancing. Come on, show us your moves. Show us your moves. Alright, she won't. I respect her decision. In you go. You're not going in, are you? Are you? Come on. Just go in. Just go in. Hey, good girl. Good doggy. Did I just call her a doggy? She's way too cute to be a dog. Right, she is in, the lid is down, too easy. All right, next in line we have Hadronici cerberea, the southern tree funnel web. I actually have two of these and I'm gonna be starting with a smaller one first. Now here's the enclosure I have prepared. This is a tree dwelling species, like I said, and in the wild it tends to almost always frequent paper bark trees, which is why I grabbed some of this to make it seem a whole lot more natural. Be very gentle here because funnel web spiders are kind of delicate. She just seemed to have wrapped herself in silk completely. There we go. So yeah, this is Hadronici cerberea. 
As you can see, it has, I've noticed this with uh, Sober Air a lot actually, the abdomen is a much lighter colour, especially in relation to the body, when compared to pretty much every other species of funnel web. So um, now it comes to fun part as per usual. Okay, so here she is in her transfer container, all huddled up and not giving a single threat pose. This is, um, this funnel web very flighty, but definitely not as defensive as some others I kept, like the Sydney funnel web you saw earlier in this video. Uh, she was fun to work with. Alright, so we'll get this little girl, hoping it's a girl anyway, into her new home. Should be pretty straightforward, but you never know with these guys. Come on. And there we are. Alright. Whack the lid on. Excellent. Now up next we have another Hadronicae, um, what's it, Cerberia. This one is a little bit larger than the other one, in fact substantially larger, and if I recall correctly is a good deal more defensive as well. Come on out. Come out and play my friend. Oh yep, we got a threat pose. See what I mean? Very different ball game from the other funnel web, even though they're the same species. Come on, just come out. There we go. Okay, so my card actually ran out of space midway through recording there. I'm not sure how much I missed, but anyway, here is the second Hadronic Siberia, the bigger, more defensive one, and we are going to be getting her into her new home right now. So this is a new setup, basically just a larger version of the other one. Nothing too spectacular, but plenty of opportunity for the funnel web to make to make her home. Come on in. Okay, she looks like she's playing dead. Playing possum. Just when she was running around all sprightly before. before. Oh, she's really playing dead. Well, you're not going to fool me. In you go. There we go. And on goes the lid. 